Is that good? Do this side. Oh. This side. Hey there, I'm Aria, and we're here in the San Fernando Valley, the heart, some might say, of the adult entertainment industry, to take a look behind the scenes at where the sausage is made here at the Vixen offices. What's up? How are you, right? How are you? Yeah. Thanks for having us. Oh, please lead the way. I don't know. I heard you guys were troublemakers. Abigail starts our day with a quick tour. So welcome to the Vixen office. This is an award-winning studio. They here. are. I mean, look at this. We got Greg Lansky, best cinematography, best specialty movie, other genre, come inside me, <laughs> best ethnic interracial series, best solo tease performance for you. You, oh, that's you. I got two of them up there. Is there a movie you've done that you're very proud of, but the awards, you know, they just snubbed it? I was a girl girl performer for three years, mm -hmm. and I never won a girl girl performance scene, which I thought was a little ridiculous because. I was very, I feel like, good at what I did. But you, I mean, you've won too. Yes. You're kind of like the Meryl Streep of the porn industry. <laughs> Wait, this looks familiar. Oh, oh she looks really. It's you, it's Abigail. Oh, it's me. <laughs> this is what my two awards were won for. You won for this? Being able to see Abigail's film with her was, was a bit of an experience. This is, oh my. <laughs> You're saying things to him. What are you saying to him here right now? I'm probably saying like, I'm gonna and I'm stuff like that. Yeah. I will say this though, I mean, you guys didn't see it. It looked incredible. The cinematography was top notch. It's like I was watching a Terrence Malick film, although I actually knew what was going on. That is such a dorky joke. Shortly after, Greg Lansky, the man many consider to be revolutionizing the porn industry, arrives. Well, today, you know, we're going to announce our newest Vixen Angel. It's a pretty big event for us, we do it every month. I created really this title and this crowning in order to celebrate the women of the adult industry in a light that is not often the case. So today is all about her. Previous angels, including Abigail, are now live on Instagram to help make the announcement. In the pink over there, that's Nicole. She's, uh, she's about to be announced uh, as the newest vixen uh, angel. I will. It's coming! Come she's right next to us. So this is the Instagram story live right now. Look at that, look at all those hearts. The only people that ever watch my Instagram stories are my parents. The newest Vixen Angel is... Nicole Aniston! Boom. Now we've moved, we're here in South Central. Is this South Central? All right, we are now here in South Central where we are shooting Nicole's angel photo shoot. It's crazy, it's very foggy in here. You can barely see, but it's looking very, very cool and it should be a very exciting afternoon. Got you covered? Uh, just trying to do what I can to help. High pressure, guys. Lots of shots to cover, you see what I'm saying? No, 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 that was nice, this one. Right there. Oh my God, amazing. You look incredible. As you're walking, give me a little. You know? Like you raised to fuck some people up. How do you feel it's gone so far? It's gone really well. Um, long day, honestly. It's really worth it. I mean, um, it's, it's a lot of fun. It's something different I've never done before. And I love the projects that he comes up with, the concepts, the ideas. They all really piece together really beautifully. To learn more about what's setting Vixen apart in the industry, I chat with Angel of the Year, Kendra Sunderland. I remember when Greg wanted to make me the very first Vixen Angel, and I just, like, I cried. And I was like, I'm just so happy because my whole life I've never been a winner. I've got last place medals for every sport possible, and so for him to, like, pick me oh. to be the very first and lead it and everything, I was just so honored. It was really overwhelming. One thing that Greg really wanted to do is to just show that this is really just artistic and our pictures are art and we deserve to be respected as artists because we're more than that. Porn doesn't just have to be this like cheap 
camera, like hotel stuff, you know? People tell us all the time, you don't even have a real job. Shooting with Greg, it's, it's more than just a job. It's like being a part of a project and something way bigger than that. So I'm really glad that he advocates for us that um, what we do is art because we get enough crap from people. It's great to have him, you know, to remind us that we are artists in what we do. Oh, Greg, right. what a day. What a day, what right? What a long day. It is uh, 7 o'clock, wrap on time. Wrap on time always. How do you feel it went, honestly? I thought it went great. Nicole was amazing. She looked really powerful. And in, in, in every one of the Vix and Angel, we really want to celebrate the women of the adult industry and show a powerful image. So, you know, it's boxing. It's coming out of a helicopter. It's all kinds of fun theme. We want to stop the preconceived notion that anything adult is cheap. It can be creative. It can be artistic. We define what we do. We want to stop having the adult industry being cast in the shadow, have people learn to, you know, question at least the preconceived notions they have of the adult industry. Because when people look at this, they see that, wow, these people put in a lot of effort, a lot of money, a lot of means just to get fantastic shots. Because that's what we're about. We like to do things grand. Grand is definitely the word I would use to sum this up. <laughs> Absolutely. I guess my, my final question for you is, if I wanted to get on your, your sure. list of male talent, right. how, how do we get that? Okay, get well, that you know, just, just write me an email, photo, front and back. Front and back? <laughs> what, what, you need a back shot? <laughs> you always need a back shot. On you that end. On that end, you always need a back shot. I'm very happy right now. <laughs>